Students received diplomas, bachelor's and master's degrees in various faculties, including natural resources and spatial science, human resources, engineering, computing and informatics, health and applied science. This is the university's 21st graduation ceremony. The Minister of Higher Education, Training and Innovation hailed the achievements and international recognition the university has received. Recently, NAS received two prestigious awards at the annual Professional Management Review Africa Awards for Higher Education or Tertiary Institutions, as well as the title of Most Innovative Institution in Namibia. She said this shows that the university is producing graduates of excellence who will contribute immensely to Namibia's economic development. As a ministry, we can never overemphasize the role of our tertiary institutions, in this case NAST, to our country's national development agenda by successfully graduating their students. Now, ladies and gentlemen, note that I have said successfully graduating their students, with a special emphasis on successfully, because there is surely a difference between graduating a student and graduating them successfully. She said the next challenge is for the university to reduce its dependence on government. Universities, particularly public universities in Namibia, must work towards ensuring that the over-dependence on government subsidy is reduced. And it can be done with good partnerships, with good initiatives from within the universities themselves. And we are looking forward to ensuring that that is done within NAST. Looking at the number of graduates that have passed here, it surely can be done we have the wealth of experts within our country. Though it was not an easy journey, according to some graduates, they were happy they completed their studies. To study and work is a hard thing, so it needs a commitment. So you need to commit yourself to, to achieve what you plan to achieve. It feels so nice to graduate. Um, it was not an easy thing to complete. The sleepless nights, failing tests, making up through um, supplementary exams and other things. It was not easy. I feel so excited to be here. Just keep going. And as the Honourable Minister also said, in today's economy and in today's world, you need to keep learning, you need to keep improving yourself. You cannot just sit back. The theme of this year's graduation ceremony was on reimagining university engagement in the knowledge economy. Selima Henok, NBC News, Ventuk.